What's going on you guys? It is Wanny back on your screen bringing a brand new video in Greenville, Wisconsin. If you are new here, make sure you smash the subscribe button down below to join the Wanny family today. And today we are going to be working at Wanny Wanny Moving and Co Company where we move the biggest mansions in all of Greenville, Wisconsin. So I'm going to message my coworker right now, let him know. Uh, we got some work to do, but first we gotta meet up for breakfast. So hey, wanna grab breakfast before work? I mean, we need to have a good, good meal before we are moving heavy, heavy furniture. So let's get on the road right now. Luckily he is a quick texter backer, so he should be meeting us there pretty quickly. So we're getting on the main road right now. It is an absolutely beautiful day here in Greenville, Wisconsin, you guys. Look at this morning sunrise. It is literally the perfect day to move furniture in and out of houses. So we are roaring down the road right now. I am so excited for breakfast. Guys, leave a comment down below. What is your favorite thing to get when you go out to breakfast? I love the breakfast bagel sandwiches. You guys definitely have to try them out. They are absolutely insane. So I'm gonna order that when we get to the burger house because I am completely starving. You know, breakfast is the best way to have energy for the day. So we have to have a good breakfast before we work a very long day. After breakfast, we're gonna head to the mansion where we have to load up all the furniture into our truck. And after that, we have to load all that furniture into a semi truck and drive it cross country, guys. So it is going to be a very long day, but I am super excited for it. I mean, we are going to be getting a pretty good paycheck from moving all this furniture. So it is gonna be well worth it. So we are finally here at the burger house right now. We're gonna head inside for breakfast and it is going to be an amazing day, you guys. It looks like my coworker is already here right on time. He loves to get a free meal here. Good morning. How are we doing this morning? Looks like he is charging his Hummer EVs. Definitely got to get a full tank of energy there. Wow, that is so cool. How much you pay for this? I hear these got a thousand horsepower. This thing is insane. Oh my gosh. 150k. Well, we better get to work because you got to pay that car payment. So let's head inside and grab some breakfast. I am starving. It's my treat. Don't worry. All right, let's head inside right now. I am so hungry, you guys. All right, here we go. All right, hi there, sir. How are we doing today? Can we get two breakfast sandwiches and a large cup of coffee, please? I think we'll have the same. Sounds pretty good to me, right? All right, thank you so much, sir. What is our total for today? You know, I did bring my coupon for the buy one, get one free breakfast meal. So, I mean, it is going to be a pretty good deal today. All right, thank you so much, sir. Appreciate it. Let's go find a table and let's wait for our food to be delivered to us. I think we got to get the nice window view, which is right over here. Seriously, guys, we cannot beat these beautiful, beautiful views here in Greenville this morning. So, Chill, you ready to move all this furniture? We got to be ready because this customer is very picky. She is very picky, demands that her furniture does not get damaged at all. She's got some very expensive stuff, so be very careful. Oh, that was super quick. Thank you so much, sir. I really appreciate it. This smells amazing. Thank you very much. Have a great day, sir, okay? Wow, this is literally the best breakfast. Seriously, smells amazing. This food is always piping hot, which is so good. All right, so remember, we have to take our time when we are moving the furniture. We cannot, we cannot make a mess, okay? Uh-oh, we're late? Hurry up, hurry up. Oh gosh, we gotta go, we gotta go. Oh my gosh, guys. This customer is very picky and she's probably gonna scream at us for being 10 minutes late. So let's get over there as fast as we can before we're even later than we are already. So let's get on the road right now. Oh my goodness, guys. I hope she does not get too upset with us. So we are roaring down the road right now. We gotta cross this median and she lives at the farm mansion which has 200 acres of land. You know, she sold it for $25 million and she's going to be moving into a huge mansion across the country, you guys. So it is going to be a very expensive move. Look at this, there's like three barns here. Look at this property is insane. I mean, it is one of the nicest places that you can buy a property here in Greenville. So we are parking right here. Let's head inside, talk with the customer and start moving the furniture as fast as we can. Hi there, ma'am, how you doing this morning? We are here to move all your furniture from Wanny, Wanny & Co. Oh my goodness. Thank you, thank you. All right, let's head inside. Uh, I was stuck in a little bit of traffic, ma'am. I do apologize about that. 
all right well we gotta lift up all this furniture uh ma'am you need to get off the couch because uh we're we're gonna be taking that you mind moving off the couch thank you very much unless you want to help <laughs> thank you all right lift that and be very careful this is italian leather okay all right let's go let's go we're gonna carry it through the doors right now oh my goodness be careful don't smash this door okay all right we're gonna throw that in the back of the hummer truck here perfect oh gosh she's watching us like an eagle over here <laughs> that's your mother surf it is a quite beautiful let me tell you all right let's keep going we got to get the leather chairs from the family room we got a lot of furniture here you guys so we need to get going here pretty quickly and then we are going to be heading to the truck station where we'll be loading this on to a huge semi truck for delivery to the new house all right there we go all right, I'm gonna head upstairs. You finish the downstairs. Make sure you get everything. Do not leave anything behind because the house closes in two days and she will not be able to get back here. So let's go upstairs here. We got this children bedroom set that we need to make sure is loaded into the truck. We got a nice bougie lamp over here. Let's get that inside and let's get that loaded into my truck. Be careful, be careful. Oh my gosh, you guys can see my suspension is going down from how much stuff we have thrown in this truck already. All right, it's looking pretty good. All right, I gotta grab a couple things from the barn. She wants some farm equipment that she's gonna be bringing with her to her new farm. It's a little bit smaller, but that is okay. It looks like they got some tools right over here. It looks like Chill is working very hard this morning. Look at my rear suspension from how much stuff Chill is throwing in the back of the truck. Oh my goodness, I might have to get that thing serviced at Lincoln's Mechanic Shop after this. Literally keeps throwing stuff. Uh, you're gonna be paying for that suspension bill. You keep filling this truck up. Oh my goodness. All right, let's throw that in the back here. All right, I think that is everything. We just gotta grab these tools from the garage. And ma'am, we're about done taking all your furniture. It's a little bit sad, but I believe, you know, you made the right decision moving to a beautiful mansion, okay? All right, we got the last of the furniture here. Thank you so much, ma'am. Uh, we will be meeting you at your new mansion. So wish us luck. You know, we're gonna be dropping off your furniture in the truck and then we'll be driving these semi trucks. All right, let's get going here. We got a lot of work ahead of us and you know, we got a long, long, long road ahead of us because we're gonna be driving these semi trucks for about 10 hours straight to the new destination. So let's head over to the truck station right now. We gotta get everything loaded up into the back of the trailer. And then we're gonna be getting on the road, you guys. I am so excited. I'm happy for this customer. I think everything has gone well. Hopefully she'll give us a nice big tip so that we can spend this money on whatever we want. You know, we've been working very hard this morning. It's only the two of us moving all this furniture. So I think she is very appreciative of us and us moving that furniture pretty quickly. So here we are at the truck station right now. We are going to be pulling in and we gotta load up all this furniture into one of these truck beds right back here. And we gotta get everything ready and set for delivery. All right, let's start loading it up here. We gotta open the back of the truck right over here. Oh my goodness, we got so much stuff. Look at my suspension in the back. It literally keeps going down. Oh my goodness, this is insane. All right couple more things and we will be getting on the road here pretty soon here all right chill finish up bringing up everything and we will see you guys when we are on the road all right everybody here we are with the truck let's finish loading up and we are going to be getting on the road in just a moment here let's close up the back of the truck right now you guys i am so excited to finally be departing greenville and we are going to be heading to the new location guys this is going to be a great trip we got our co-worker right here in his semi truck as well so let's go you guys we're turning on our bed lights because it is going to be getting dark out here pretty soon so let's get on the road everybody all right we are getting on the main highway right now you guys i am so excited i've not driven a truck for a while so hopefully everything goes well you know i am a trained professional at wanny wanny driving school so everything should go pretty smoothly here so we are going to be getting on the main highway in just a moment you guys and then we should be arriving at the customer's house in about 10 more hours you know it is a very very long trip but it will be well worth it when this customer has their luxury furniture in their brand new house you guys so i mean look at these amazing views as we depart greenville and head south I mean, it is just an absolutely great job driving a truck. We get to experience the world, 
hang out with everybody. So it is just super, super cool. I mean, we have our coworker following behind right now. As you can see, this customer literally has so much furniture. You know, imagine trying to deliver it with one truck. It would just not be possible at all. So we're gonna be taking a right turn over here and we should be getting on the highway here pretty soon. And then it'll be a nice, smooth, straight shot to the customer's house, which is super exciting. All right, you guys, here we go. We're getting on the highway right now. Oh gosh, this is a deep dip, everybody. Here we go. Finally, we're gonna max this puppy and we're gonna get there as fast as we can. We're gonna be going through the forest, you guys. Look at these amazing views. Oh my gosh, this is so cozy, so nice. We have our navigation system on it. It says we'll be arriving there at 6 a.m. Looks like we might even be cutting through the desert. And apparently it is about 120 degrees in the desert. So it is not a great place to break down at all. Look at the cactuses, everybody. This is so cool. Oh my goodness, you guys. Seriously, this is the best part of being a truck driver. You get to explore the world and see everything. Oh my gosh, look at my coworker. He is going so fast. He literally just passed us right now. We're literally going 75 miles per hour. Wonder how fast he's going. He's probably going 100 right now. Hopefully he knows how to handle that truck. We're gonna try and catch up with him right now. My, my foot is to the floor. We are trying to catch up with him right now. Oh my goodness, you guys. He's going so fast. Oh my gosh, I'm nervous for him. Uh, this is Wanny Winnie, trucker to my coworker. Uh, you need to slow down over there. Please slow down. Thank you. Oh my gosh, he's making me really nervous going that fast. Look at him going around these curves like he's a race car driver. We're literally driving huge semi trucks with very expensive furniture. So he cannot make any mistakes, you guys. And it is getting pretty dark out here very quickly. We have our high beam lights on. It gets very dark in the desert very quickly as well. So, oh my gosh, look at him go. He's literally going so fast. Uh oh. It looks like he just copied over. He said he has a flat tire and he's losing control. Are you kidding me right now? Uh-oh. Oh my goodness, you guys. Uh, where is he? He literally said on the radio that he has a flat tire and he's lost control. Uh-oh, this is not good at all, you guys. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. He is literally like in the middle of the road. Whoa! Oh my. He's losing control. He's swerving all over the place right now. Uh, you need to pull over. Hit the emergency brake. Oh my goodness, you guys. This is not good. This is not good at all. Oh my goodness. Hopefully, he can stop his truck. Oh, we almost smashed into him. Oh my gosh. We got the emergency hazards on right now, guys. This is insane. We got to put the truck in park. Are you okay? Oh my goodness. Seriously. You were going so fast. I could not believe you were going that quick down the highway. He was going 110 miles per hour. We got the hazards on right now. Looks like you blew off these back two tires here. Let me get the spares. Oh my gosh. Hopefully nobody needs to get down this main road at all, you guys. Seriously, this is unbelievable. I cannot believe it. All right, we got to get the spare tires in my truck, and we're going to change these out pretty quickly here. Guys, we're literally in the middle of nowhere right now. I seriously cannot believe you had to break down in the middle of the desert. I can hardly see out here, it is so dark. All right, we gotta install these two tires right here. Literally blew them out. Looks like you literally ran over a cactus. Are you serious? Oh my word. All right, well that should be good. Try starting it up. We should be good, okay? All right, we're gonna be getting back on the road right now. Cannot believe we literally hit a cactus. Unbelievable. But you guys, luckily I was there to save the day. Otherwise, he probably would have been stranded in the middle of a desert, which is not a good thing at all. All right, here we go, everybody. He is getting on the road again. All right, we got to start up our truck. Please don't hit us. Please don't hit us. Okay, good. Luckily, he did go to Wanny Wanny Driving School, so he definitely knows how to drive. Here we go, everybody. We are roaring down the road right now. I think it's my turn to take the lead here, everybody. I'm going to try to do a pass here. I can hardly see ahead of us. Trying to do it faster, but my coworker is literally stepping on the gas again. I literally could not pass him. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Slow down. You might crash again. All right, here we go, everybody. We are going so fast on the road right now. Oh, my gosh. Looks like they might have shut down the highway down here. Are you serious? All right, we got to take the exit because this part of the highway is literally shut down right now. You can hardly see ahead of us right now. It is completely dark out right now. We're supposed to be arriving at the customer's house in about three more hours. We have been driving 
for seven hours. So it has been very exhausting, very tiring. So we have a little bit further in the trip and then we'll be getting this amazing furniture to the customer's house right now. I cannot believe how dark it is here in the desert. You know, I am not used to this, used to driving with street lights everywhere in Greenville. This is a very, very different experience. Luckily they have these reflectors so you can see where to turn and where you need to go. Oh my goodness, you guys, this is just insane. Uh, my brakes are locked up. Oh my goodness. Whoa! Whoa! Oh! Oh my word. Are you serious right now? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, my truck, it's literally stuck. This is not good at all. Oh my goodness, you guys, my truck. I literally rammed into the wall over here. Oh my goodness, my coworker is going to be so mad at me. Oh my gosh, guys, we are never gonna get this furniture delivered. He's literally so upset right now. He's literally trying to back it up, back it up. Oh my gosh, I think we're gonna have to load up all the furniture into his truck. Hopefully we can squeeze everything in there, but I am not too sure that it will fit. Oh my goodness, you guys, this is just not going good at all. Maybe I should have just stayed in Greenville. You know, I am not a trained professional truck driver. I'm just a professional car driver. All right, guys, we gotta get the furniture in his truck because we cannot get my truck working. I cannot believe I lost control. My brakes literally locked up and I cannot steer. I am not kidding you right now. You see the truck, it's in the ditch over there. It's not looking good. We're gonna be late because of you. Well, calm down, we had to stop for your flat tires. No need to argue. Oh my gosh. Well, back up your truck. You think I'm gonna carry a thousand pound couch 50 miles down the road? Oh my goodness, guys. Coworkers literally screaming at me. This is not my fault at all. Probably because we had to stop 20 times for his flat tires. We had to make this mistake, you guys. All right, he's backing up right now. Thank goodness. Oh my goodness, guys. This has been one of the craziest, craziest moving trips we've ever had to experience here. We're gonna load up the furniture here in his truck. Thank goodness we have a dolly to get everything in here. All right, that should be everything. Let's get back on the road. I'll sit shotgun in your truck, okay? All right, well, I guess I gotta ride in the passenger seat here. Hopefully, uh, hopefully he can let me in. What is going on here? I literally cannot get in. All right, there we go, there we go. The door was literally open a hundred times. Here we go, everybody. Well, we're just gonna have to leave my truck there. Hopefully a tow truck will be getting that in the morning, you guys. It has been a crazy experience moving this furniture cross country, you know. I hope you guys did enjoy today's video. If you guys did, make sure you guys drop a like, leave a comment, and don't forget to subscribe to join the Wanny family today. Thanks for watching, everybody, and we will see you in the next one. Bye, everybody.